Nature Boy rented a room from a friend in Atlanta. It was at some point during this time that Nature Boy contacted Young Pharaoh on Facebook and the two of them built a cordial online friendship. Soon after meeting each other, Young Pharaoh secured himself an interview with Sonetta TV. Nature Boy offered to get Pharaoh a ride from his home in Buffalo, New York to the interview which was in Harlem. Nature Boy drove from Atlanta all the way here to New York to see me. You know what I mean? I just had I just finished having a conversation with somebody. I'm on a, I'm on a you know, I'm still on the way to New York right now. Young Farrell says when they got to the interview, he asked Sonetta if Nature Boy could come up so he didn't have to wait in the car. Sonetta agreed. That's the whole even way Nature Boy even came to fuck up. You would have never even seen this nigga on camera. It was during this interview that Young Pharaoh and Nature Boy's friendship would come to an ultimate end. I got the young guard here, Brother Pharaoh. Pharaoh has came all the way from um, Buffalo, New York. And um, my brother Nature is here from Atlanta. First, I want to talk to my brother Nature. Why are you so infatuated, my brother? We're going back to Africa. Talk to the people. The tropical man belongs between the Tropic of Cancer and the Tropic of Capricorn. What does that mean? If you look on the map of an equator. At this time, Pharaoh is mad at Nature Boy because Pharaoh came to do the interview, but he brought Nature Boy with him. This is my first time meeting Nature Boy. This is my first time meeting young Pharaoh. And so Pharaoh is getting heated because I, I'm starting to ask him questions first. You can look at Pharaoh's face and be like, nigga, you getting the limelight, nigga? I'm the one going to here. <laughs> but I didn't know all this. I'm thinking they cool. I'm doing the interview. This nigga jumps in the interview, grab the mic. 1,300, maybe 1,500 people watching. We live. So I'm trying to be smooth because this is my first time being on this platform and I don't want my first impression, you know, to be fucked up. So I grabbed the mic back from the nigga. Mind you, we never supposed to even had the mic. So somebody called in and was like, yo, I know that nigga, that nigga gay. So Nature Boy gets to arguing, screaming at the top of his fucking lungs, embarrassing the fuck out of me on this live stream. Now I'm on fire because I'm feeling wild disrespected. Cause I'm like, nigga, I don't even know you. At the end of this whole thing, young Pharaoh and Nature Boy was getting ready to fight. So I had to let the nigga know, like, listen, I'm not trying to be egotistical. I'm not trying to do none of that, but don't ever snatch no motherfucking mic out my motherfucking hand, my nigga. So we getting into it. So now we arguing. So boom, we go our second, we go our separate ways. That was my first and last time meeting a nigga. Although Young Pharaoh and Nature Boy would never see each other again face to face, their beef was far from over.